Hallöchen, Hallöchen, Hallöchen. Herzlich willkommen zurück zu Ignorance is Strength Orwell. Also eigentlich umgekehrt. So, ähm, wir schauen weiter nach Ilya, weil darum geht's, um den geht es mir ja eigentlich. So, wir haben jetzt ein bisschen bei Karen gewuselt, aber eigentlich habe ich mich entschieden, nach Ilya zu gehen. Hey, then we're going to see you again. It's good to for the love. This is your public profile, everyone. Everything you enter here is visible. Bla, 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 bla. I'm looking for women 30 and 40, athletic, gaming, golf, riding, whiskey, smoking, opinionated, know-it-alls, dogs. Okay. Your opinions. What are you looking for most in a potential partner? True love, social connection, humor. How long do you wish for your next relationship to last? Forever. Would you consider allowing your partner seeing other people? No. Would you consider dating someone who does not want or dislike children? Yes. What places? You can go to vacation, cities, cultural hotspots, hundreds and politics. Are you not at all? Ha ha ha. Are you a cat or dog person? Cat. If you turn left hand and gloves inside out, it fits the right hand. What is this question? Okay, your conversations. Laura Lama. Hey, how, how you doing, cutie? Wasn't much on your profile, but you look so hot. I need to message you right away, lol. So I'm Laura, and right now I'm just looking for some to go see moose with maybe snuggle up at night. Why don't you back you? Hi, Laura, I don't know how to respond to this, so I guess I won't. I'm not sure why you thought that me being a cutie was enough, but it really wasn't better luck next time. Astro Jazz. Hey, damn good coffee. There's not a lot to go on from what little is on your profile, but for some reason, singular things we should will be a good match, and so I'm going for it. What are your favorite games to blow off some steam with? Right now, I'm trying to play through Dash Iguana Perfectly Sane Trilogy, but it's just so much harder than the originals. No matter how hard I try, I keep falling down the pits and dying over and over again. I also spend some time with Don't Starve, <laughs> which is really cool, but I barely make it past the first few days. Anyway, I hope to hear from you soon. I've been stalking the fields looking for robot dinosaurs in the game Skyline Infinite, Infinite Dawns. I'm usually not into those crafting survival games, but there's something I find quite romantic about leaving society behind and trying to make do with nothing but your wits, some tricks and some hope. Haven't checked Dash out yet. Checked out Dash yet, the reviews have me sitting on the fence. I haven't had a chance to check out the Skyline yet. Check out Skyline yet, but the videos have me intrigued. Might pick it up during the next sale. So what do you work? What do you for work? Right now I'm about to start my dream job. I was accepted to become a trainee train driver, which is super exciting. Soon I'll be carrying passengers all across the nation and who knows beyond. It's all very exciting, but also a little daunting. Trainee train driver, that sounds like a lot of responsibility, but that is fantastic that you have pursued your lifelong dream. I work for a leading pharmaceutical company, not entirely exciting, but pays the bills. Everyone needs medicine, right? Being from Bonten, I'm guessing you're at Watergate, is that correct? Yeah, Watergate, you're right, but I'd rather not talk about it. Don't exactly enjoy working there. Okay, das könnte vielleicht noch witz, äh, witzig sein, wichtig sein. Sorry, I totally get that. Forget I said anything. So what are your plans for the weekend? Maybe we could meet for coffee. I'm working, maybe some other time. That's cool, I understand. Hey, how was the weekend? Mine was pretty hectic. A friend of mine dragged me to Bonten to see the Targets play a show, but they never turned up. The next day we heard that the band had called it quits, but didn't bother to tell the venue or any of their fans. The rumor mill has been swelling, but at least there was support act, I suppose. Wow, that sounds like a mess. I just worked, nothing exciting. You sound a little down. How about that coffee sometime this week? I'd really like to meet you. Not sure if I can, I'm a little busy. Oh, okay. Well, maybe you just messaged me if you change your mind. Da haben wir noch Mary P. I can't believe we're doing this, dating and all. What can I say? I haven't stopped thinking about the magical evening we had the other week at the hotel. I haven't either, although I must admit I'm a bit on edge. Are you sure this is a good idea? Calm down, Ilya. Everything is going to be alright. Nothing bad will come for you. Will come your way, I'll make sure of it. I've been doing a lot of thinking. My brother's reach seems to grow stronger and stronger each day, as do his crackpot theories about who are wronging him, who's watching him, and who conspires with whom to ruin either parties or his reputation. Was ist da? Haben wir denn? Okay, den, den, den Widerspruch kennen wir noch nicht. I can't even take a good damn, goddamn piss without him timing me these days, or at least that's what it's beginning to feel like. I don't know how much longer I can stand this. Well, perhaps a bit more distance between you and him could be helpful. You told me you've been writing a lot of articles for him lately. 
You're right. Back in the day, it was all for nobility, for a cause. Now it's just a mishmash of reasons. Most of them I don't agree with. I don't think I can go on like this much longer. And I don't think we believe in the same causes anymore. Oha, oha, das ist interessant. It is okay not to believe in the same things as him. You have your own life, Ilya. You don't always have to stay the younger brother. It always makes me feel better to talk to you. I think I gotta see you again. Hmm, want to meet again? How about Thursday? Of course I do, but another day? I have a late shift on April 13th. Thursday would be best. Can, can't you swap shifts with someone? We don't meet too often lately, but I figure something out. Great, looking forward to it. Yeah, me too. So I hope you don't regret spending April 13th with me instead of your late shift. Thanks for the lovely evening yesterday and the amazing night. Likewise, being with you is, I don't know what to say, amazing. <laughs> Der Konflikt ist wahrscheinlich die E-Mail, wo er sagt, er war da. Ja, genau. Okay, also, äh, das disablen wir und gehen zum Konflikt und sagen, dass er da auf, wirklich auf einem Date war. Goddamn, so he was on a date at the time in question. That means Ilias of our hook, we can get him, get him for having been on a date. I think it would be wise to turn to Karen now and investigate her further. Oh. Aber, aber... Ich wollte doch Karen gar nicht. Ich, Karen, ich wollte dich doch nicht. Na gut, jetzt muss ich wohl, ne? Äh, Patient Database. Der Molly kann ich wahrscheinlich nicht. Doch hier Molly vielleicht. Molly. Ob das hilft, weiß ich nicht. Hm. Äh, auch Social Security Number. bin gerade versucht mal nach ihm zu gucken hier. This patient is inactive, okay. Ilya Vard immigrated to the nation in February 2011. He was placed in the outer bond reception camp together with his brother Raban Vard, who is, only known who is his only known family member. Mr. Vard fled his hometown Prava to escape the Pagesian war after his brother Raban had been severely injured during a bombing. Mr. Vard had been taking care of his brother with great devotion. Das ist auch wieder offiziell, oder? Das ist auch nicht offiziell, das ist halt schwierig. However, since his arrival, Mr. Vard has, show, has shown signs of severe distress and trauma. Symptoms include anxiety, nightmares, insomnia and lack of appetite. Okay, die hat gesagt, wir sollen uns auf Karen konzentrieren, aber, aber, aber... Äh, wir disablen das und machen mal das andere nochmal dazu. Ich weiß es nicht. Hmm, knowing this could prove valuable, although the fact alone probably won't help us. Wir haben bald 6 Uhr. Kacke. Machen wir nochmal den Draft. Okay, das, ich habe keine Lust, den immer wieder vorzulesen. Das ist wahrscheinlich immer im Prinzip genau dasselbe. Nur ein bisschen abgeändert. So. Ähm. auf Karen zurück. Wird da noch irgendwas finden? Achso, das war das. Ich würde gerne irgendwas über diese Molly rausfinden. Warte mal, hier war auch keine Molly dabei, oder? Nee, Mary P. Da kann ich auch nicht auf die Profile, alles klar. Ja, das ist auch uninteressant. Was der für ein Spiel spielt. Ja, dass er nicht gerne da arbeitet. Hm. Weiß ich nicht, ob das wichtig ist. Ich 
immer seine, seine Krankheiten mit hier. Vielleicht können wir da irgendwie einen medizinischen Zugriff für irgendwas. If Raban has a provocation plan for 6 pm, we best hurry. Only two more hours to do something about it. So, das war also doch falsch. Das war also doch, doch nicht richtig. Ähm. Achso, ah, okay, die haben wir ja schon. ich auch nicht als so wichtig an, wenn ich ehrlich bin. Vielleicht hilft uns das noch weiter. Refugee Counselor, Therapeutic Counselor. Vielleicht ändert das irgendwas? Well then, let's find out what's so therapeutic about Karen. Ja, das weiß ich nicht. Then how does the National Army Veteran fit in here exactly? Ja, das ist die Frage. Und die Frage ist auch, wie, wie... Warte mal, ich könnte ihn noch mal vielleicht suchen. He feels deeply responsible for what has happened, but is unable or unwilling to describe the exact events. He's reclusive and aggressive. Ich würde halt irgendwie gern mehr über diese Molly wissen, aber ich weiß nicht, wie wir das, wie wir das rausfinden können. Molly. Da haben wir auch sonst nichts, außer, außer das. Ich überlege, haben wir sonst nicht irgendwo schon mal was über Molly gelesen? Wir hätten irgendwo schon mal irgendwo den Namen Molly gelesen. Ich, bin, ich weiß aber nicht mehr wo. Ziehen, okay. Aber was wir vielleicht da reinziehen können. Ähm. Da vielleicht was finden. Vielleicht noch mal Oak Street. Okay, da gibt es auch nichts. Schade. Okay, da gibt es irgend irgendwas von den Sachen, die ich jetzt gesagt habe, die sind nicht wichtig, sind scheinbar wichtig. dass er nicht gerne da arbeitet. No wonder he's unreliable lately. Oh, oh gut, es ist wieder was passiert. Sehr gut. Äh. Warum kann ich denn nicht hier Mollys Nummer nehmen? Ah, Ilya, hey you, hey, what's up? I just wanted to see whether the website I set up for you is still running. Yeah, all good. Guess I totally forgot even thank you for it. How about catching up for a coffee sometime? Just about seen. Great to hear, it's all good. You don't need to thank me. Come on, Ilya, it's the least I can do. Well, I won't say no to that. Maybe we can also go around Hop if you like. Sure thing, hey. <sighs> warte, 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 warte. Die haben auch Hop gespielt. Moment, 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 Moment. Moment, Moment, Moment. Uh, wo, wo ist Hop hier? Hop, 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 hop. Da.
Einfach nur mal, um zu gucken. Ne, okay, schade. Hätte ja sein können. Hätte ja sein können. So. Has a private website. Die Frage, ob wir, das, ob wir die rausfinden können. So, she has her own website. We may be able to uncover from Ilias files, but we need a bit more info on before we go there. Wait, the apartment she had scheduled at the time was with Ilya. Karen had a session scheduled with Ilya at the time she was supposed to meet this Molly. That sure sounds like a cover. We need to find out whether there's a legal record of this Molly in Karen's files. If not, she will be in serious trouble. But I doubt you find anything with just Molly. We need a full name first. Oh yeah, bitte. Uh, bitte, bitte, bitte. Okay, ein Chat. Where are you? Can you please get back to me? Fragen, mit wem chattet er denn? Hello? Beziehungsweise sie. Molly, ah. Oh, hey Karen, what is it? We had a session scheduled for this morning, remember? I forgot, sorry. Can we reschedule? You forgot? You can't just forget a session, this is serious. I had to work urgently at Circle Mall, it just came up. We've already rescheduled it before. Yeah, because you suddenly wanted to. <laughs> I can't shift stuff around like you can. I have to take the work when it's on offer. Working again? How long this time? 10 hours, 12 hours? What about your kid? He needs his mother. Listen. You don't have children. You have a good job. You have no idea what it's like. Zero. Don't you dare judge me again about not being there for my son. You're right. I don't know what it's like for you, sorry, but only because you're being so reclusive. You're pulling out of everything slowly, steadily, stonewalling. It gives me nightmares because it's my duty to help and I can't fulfill it. We should sit down, talk about what's going on with your life for once. We did already. When I wrote you on that counseling website of yours, you said we were able to assist me. You were able... Okay, but nothing is different. Talk, talk, talk is all you do. And taking photos even though I said no. Nothing gets any better through that. I'm done talking. Got, to, got work to do now. So, no more sessions. Noted. And for the record, I'm not waiting for you to come back. Good. Yet another hashtag trending. Someone has been busy. Ja, 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 Moment, Moment, Moment. Äh, das könnte noch wichtig sein, dass sie ihre private Counseling-Website da hat. Her own Counseling-Website. This could mean Karen is moonlighting. This may very well be the page that Ilias set up for Karen. It's likely we'll find more about this page within Ilias files then. Okay. Jetzt schauen wir erstmal, was für ein Hashtag. Oh, only one more hour before the article is released. We must prevent this. We must. Oh Gott, oh Gott, oh Gott, oh Gott, oh Gott, oh Gott. <lacht> The people silencing. Interesting that your wife is conducting private constant session with National Army veterans un unofficially because officially she's meeting your brother. What else she tried to hide? Or should I say, what are you? What the fuck didn't you say you were against the National Army? Okay, da geht's ganz schön rund. Okay, um, in 
Ilias Files, genau. Open Soteria. Da haben wir noch die. Das haben wir schon ewig gelesen, diesen Text. Und jetzt wissen wir auch, was das ist. Open Soteria. Pff. Good work, though. Seems not even her husband is aware of this little side business she's built up there. Let's just have a look. Welcome. I'm glad you found my website. I'm a professional psychotherapist with a degree in psychology and, psychology and medicine. I offer advice, mentoring, and support for victims of armed conflict. Blah, blah, blah. Okay, read stories. Ja, Bill. Wir suchen ja eher nach Molly. Da ist Molly. Molly, aber make sure you see the proper counseling. Das können wir aber nicht nehmen als Foto für Molly, okay? Uh, read your messages. Molly, seeking advice. Hello, psychology person. I'm having some psycho problems. Since you seem to have some sort of psychology degree, I figured you might be able to help me, Molly. Dear Molly, what an odd request. You sound like you don't really want to talk to me. What are those psycho problems you're experiencing? Looking forward to your response. Hi, Sotary. I have insomnia. I'm, in cons I'm constantly in pain. I work in a low-wage job, which frankly is beneath me. I can barely afford daycare for my son. All of this is because of the damn government and that safety bill. It stops people like me from succeeding in life after the service. I'm not sure if you can help me, but I'm running out of alternatives. Dear Molly, okay. Now we can start the issue one, insomnia and pain. How long have you been suffering from, from insomnia? Was there an incident in your life that you think may have triggered this? With the pain, is there a physical injury you are suffering from or is it just general pain? How long does it typically, typically affect you? Issue two, low wage job and low income. Could you tell a little more about your experience and qualifications? Did you complete secondary school, college, college? What career did, path did you have previously? Issue three, finding the right person to speak to. I believe you already have. I'm more than qualified to offer you support, but if you find that this doesn't work out, I can direct you to someone else who is more suitable for your needs. Waiting for you, blah, blah, blah. Hi, all right, I've never done this before. I was a combat engineer, a veteran in the army of the nation. They kept telling me what an invaluable soldier I was. I believed them, holding my head high and serving their needs, no questions asked. Then I lost the only person I ever loved. He was part of my unit. I felt like my heart had been sucked out of my chest, squeezed through a hole in the size of a pinhead. After I lost him, I didn't care about anything. I left my regiment. <laughs> and was discharged for being absent without leave. Then my son Michael was born. I had to pick myself up no matter how I was feeling about the loss of his father. I need to be strong, but I'm not strong. I'm still suffering. If it wasn't for my son, I would never be, have reached out to you. I've never spoken to anyone about this, and quite frankly, viewing your website, I felt like it was kindergarten for crybabies. But I guess everyone seeks some help. I need yours. Hello, Molly. Insults aside, I think... This is quite typical of ex-soldiers to feel that self-help and psychotherapy shows weakness. I find it quite interesting that despite your doubts and pre prejudices, you chose to reach out to me. There's, this, is no, this is no small feat, in fact, as it shows that you're determined to face your issues and better yourself, no matter how difficult that may be. You are on the road to healing. This feeling of loss, this overwhelming tide of emotion that you are experiencing, it sounds like you are suffering from PTSD, post-traumatic stress syndrome, is a common condition that many former ex-soldiers suffer from after experiencing a great deal of trauma during war. The good news that is that with counseling, the symptoms of PTSD can be treated. How about I offer you some private sessions free of charge? In exchange, I would like to publish your story anonymously, of course, on my blog. Female soldiers are so rarely spoken about And I feel that your story in particular would be extremely valuable to other former service women who feel they cannot speak up. Fine, I don't like the idea of sharing my story, but I also cannot afford treatment. So as long as it's 100% anonymous, I consent. Dear Molly, I'm so glad that you're willing to share and help others who really need the support. I promise that I won't let you down. I'd like to focus on your remarks about the safety bill in my article because the political criticism is sure to fuel some discussions. But to make sure I get your story right, I think it'd be best if we would meet in person, take time to talk things through, even take some photos if that's okay. I would like to suggest the cafe at Freedom Plaza for the meeting. That should make for a fine setting for an article with some political punch behind it. Ja, das äh, nehme ich mal sehr gerne mit. Freedom Plaza, everyone's favorite meeting place, apparently. Well, not anymore after yesterday's bombing, I suppose. We can meet 
there if it helps the article, but no photos from me, keep me anonymous. I promise to keep you out of everything I write on here. Okay. Oh, wir haben schon wieder überzogen. Äh, Entschuldigung. Wir machen eine kleine Pause. Äh, wir sehen uns in der nächsten Folge wieder. Ich danke euch sehr fürs Zusehen und äh, die Zeit läuft. Bis zum nächsten Mal bei All Will Ignorance is Strength. Macht's gut. Tschüsschen.